Hey, welcome to this Windows channel and this is a tips and tricks video. I actually did a video on this app uh, many months ago, but it has been improved and I really, really like it and I think it's a tool that's just amazing to have on any Windows 10 computer or tablet when you're using Wi-Fi wherever you go. So it's called Wi-Fi Analyzer. You go on the Windows Store, just type Wi-Fi and you'll see Wi-Fi Analyzer. And this is uh, a very, very, very nice app. So Wi-Fi Analyzer is a really cool tool. You know, we often have Wi-Fi problems and it happens quite often that it's not really our fault actually. People think, well, you know, it's uh, my computer maybe or my router or, well, Wi-Fi Analyzer is cool because it's going to tell you uh, how crowded your area is and what even suggests what channel you should use. Once it's installed, all you have to do is start the app. And what you see is this little uh, picture here. First of all, it tells you uh, the strength of your Wi-Fi signal. So it's in decibels per meter. And it tells you the name of your um, you know, wireless network, the channel used, the frequency of the channel, bandwidth. It gives you what type of protection encryption. So if you're not sure, you know, you're wondering, did my friend, did someone that installed my router really do it correctly? What type of encryption I have in security? Of course, the best is WPA2 AES. And you have other details. On the top, you see the connected. You can click Analyze. And this is cool because you have a graphical way of viewing all the signals around you. And the higher they get in the scale, the stronger they are. Notice that my Wi-Fi is right here, pretty much smack in the middle of another signal that's very strong. And actually, that signal, I know where it comes from, comes from my next door neighbor that's just below me. And so um, router must be probably in the same room I am. So it's actually stronger than my own network. So you let it there, you let it do its job and it will tell you information at the bottom here. So let's take the little arrow, minimize, and you'll see the different channels and the number of stars to give you an idea of which channel would be better for your connection. So here, channel two is only one stars and that's what I'm using. That means that I should go in my router and change the channel to another one. And it has a recommended channel when you look at it and the recommended channel is channel 11 because there's no overlapping signals or very little or the ones that are overlapping are actually much weaker than my signal so it gives you an idea of where you should go so this is a really 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 cool uh, analyzer on the bottom here you have an icon you can switch to 5 gigahertz band if you want to have an idea of your 5 gigahertz usage uh, you have a graph in another type of graph available. You also have the possibility to view all sorts of information, including SSID, so you know the network names of your neighbors. And you have also a little menu here that uh, shows you basically uh, all sorts of um, information that you can check for on this um, Wi-Fi analyzer. And finally, you have networks where you can see all the different networks that actually has been at some point detected by your computer. Some very weak that are not often there, but it does tell you that there are some networks that sometimes appear. And it tells you, look at all the networks that you actually can see. So it's pretty amazing. And there's indications like here, it says that this is not protected. Uh, and so on. So it's very, very nice and it's a great app to analyze the environment around you, 
trying to find and you know what as soon as I'm over with this video first thing that I'll do is go in my router change the channel to channel 11 because that's the one that the analyzer is telling me is the best for my situation so Wi-Fi analyzer totally free a very amazing little app to analyze and to check why maybe you have problems receiving your Wi-Fi signal and you know what if you have a big house or your big home and you have tendency to have problems when it's you know you're far away why not analyze with this and check out the suggestion of the channel that they give you go in that room where the signal is difficult to receive check out how strong your signal is and check out if maybe you can move change the channel to something else you know in a router it's always set automatic for the channel selection but usually is a bad idea it's much better to actually set it manually by watching what type of signals are the strongest at certain areas and you know if you move around in your home you go in another part of your home you decide that that's where you're gonna work that's where your computer is now gonna be why not just analyze again because these signals change so you can be moving in an area where uh, the channel you're using is actually more congested and might want to move it away from there so uh, check it out Wi-Fi analyzer in the store free of charge amazing and you can check 5 and 2.4 and 4 gigahertz band router uh, channels if you enjoy my videos want to subscribe to my channel you'll be informed when your videos are online give us thumbs up if you like the videos and um, give us you know any common suggestions any video maybe you'd like to see about a subject let me know and I'll try to post a video um, if possible.